Right, testing one, two, four. Let's sit on. <laughs> so this is going to be quite a boring video because I kind of cheated. Um, but I'm going to go through how to build a flirt pole and what a flirt pole is. Um, I was going to build it out of PVC just because I have a bunch of it in the garage. However, I popped tractor supply yesterday and da -da -da -da, found a whip for $9. So I'm going to use this because this has more flexibility, which means I can put the toy on the end and I can have, and it's more fun. Okay, so I am going to find some string, a nice bit of cord, cord would be great for this. Um, I don't have any cord. I have some like weird plastic stuff that Lawrence leaves about everywhere. So I'm going to use that uh, and then find him a toy. So I'll cut this. I'll be back in a second. attach any toy to this so you know the ones I mean they usually have a handle on um, tug toy for agility that's a very popular one um, we have this crinkly toy that we got for Christmas that could be quite good but this is his favorite toy at the moment so I'm gonna somehow tie it to Mr. Squirrel this is from Dollar Tree by the way he loves this super squirrel <laughs> like fishing. I can't really get this all in here, I should have stood back a bit. Um, and now I will cut to him playing with it outside to make more sense as to how this works. Ready? Are you ready? Go get it. Go get it. Go. Go. Go get it. Go get it. Ready? a nine dollar flirt pole if you don't include the uh, price of the toy and some string that you find um great for tiring dogs out in a short space and good for direction uh, it's just good fun it means i don't have to run around so enjoy <laughs> 